What's up, Survivor Fanatics? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my subsistence. Let's play this episode 6. And, oh man. So get this, I let four pieces of meat burn between videos. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm just not feeling well, you know? I'm not, like, 100% there, so, you know, that kind of stuff's gonna happen, I guess. But, uh, it's not looking good with us, uh, not starving to death now. But, we're gonna see what we can do. We're gonna go ahead and, tr let's, uh, start this bad boy up. We're going to use the generator a little bit. I know I... Eh. Uh, see, the thing is, I want to use the generator because I need electricity to make myself a lockpick. But the thing is, I'm not going to wait around for 500 electricity. So running the generator right now for that lockpick is completely pointless. Because by the time I'm done farming for the day, I'll have 500 power. So that's kind of worthless. Uh, and I'm not going to have it before I go out. So let's, uh, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's put this stuff down here. And we'll put the wood away. We will hold on to our health kit. And we're gonna, we'll are gonna hold on to the bandages. And we'll stop this. And let's take a look at our tomatoes. They didn't grow during the night because they had no uh, light. But now they do have light. So they're growing. And uh, light's only 20%. But, you know, I'm assuming that'll go up, you know, as time goes on. Uh, yeah, so let's go doing some farming. Uh, I'm doing something I don't normally do. I'm making two videos in one day. And I don't normally like to do that because I don't like to do, like, too much farming on camera. But the fact of the matter is, because I was sick this weekend, I'm really behind on my videos. So I'm going to have to do another farming video. I could grab some pistol rounds and kill that wolf, but uh, I think I'm going to hold off on that for right now. I'm going to see if I can catch a chicken, maybe. I just hope I don't find any lockboxes. That'll suck. Not that finding lockboxes suck, but it kind of sucks that... When you find one without a key. Right, I just got some blueberries you can see right there. Um, blue, uh, you know, the whole fruits and vegetables and protein thing, you can survive on one or the other. It's just your stamina won't be as good unless you have both of them properly, you know, unless you're properly fed, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Um, how is my thirst? Yeah, my thirst isn't looking good either. We're going to go ahead and eat these, though. That should help with our stamina. We're going to need some stamina for running around. Um, I usually like to go pretty far off my base, but I'm not going to go out that far today because of my stamina issues. I don't want to get caught out really far away from my base. Um, so let's just be careful here and uh, do some looting. I'm definitely going to start cutting out more of this looting. Uh, I don't mind showing some looting, but you know I don't like showing too much. But yeah, then it can't be helped today because uh, I'm just so behind on YouTube. And then uh, I was supposed to have someone work for me on Monday, but my boss was like, nope, I need him at the main store. I was like, damn it. And I was already off Friday because I was sick, so I can't even complain. <laughs> so, what are you going to do? Uh, but next week will be a full week, but the week after that will be an extremely short week. I got someone working for me on Monday, and I also have Thanksgiving. So, I'll be off a lot of days. A lot of days next week, or the week after. Drink. Yeah, stamina is really going to be a problem. We might have to kill an animal. Um, I don't really have anything against her killing the animal. I just don't want to waste matches on a fire. You know what I mean? I like to use my fires to keep me warm at night and kill the animals. Uh, cook the animals, sorry. Uh, so, not really sure. But, you know, my stamina is just going down very quickly and not really coming up very quickly. And that is a... That is because I do not have enough protein. Let's just collect chests for now, and uh, I think I'm going to shoot something. Probably find a level 1 wolf or something. Try not to burn the meat this time. I think from now on when I'm cooking meat, I'm just going to pause the video, because, you know... Uh, basically, I was just, like... Yeah, it was just annoying. It was just annoying. I'm frustrated that I, I threw away four meat. But, it's kind of funny. Makes it more challenging. Well, it's definitely funny. Funny for you guys, anyway. Uh, that's it. Animals, so let's go this way. We can get up on our base from this angle, so... I think I'm gonna have to cook something. I can't be out there with this stamina like this. Alright, let's, uh, let's go get our gun and shoot something. Uh, we won't be able to get up from this, from this way soon. Gonna have to put a stairway going that way as well. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab our pistol. And some ammo. There we go. And that is a bear. I don't know. I, I kind of feel like killing bears is kind of pointless. 
you know, they just take more ammo, and, like, I don't feel like I get much more, although I haven't been killing enough of them to really be able to tell. Let's take a look around. Don't see nothing. Okay. Well, let's keep looting, and, uh, you know, if we find a wolf or something, we'll, we'll waste them. Oh, what is that? That's a bear. And I just heard a wolf. Where's that wolf? Oh, there he is. Okay, let's get this wolf. Damn it! I hear two. Is there two over there? Or was that just like... It sounded like there was two. Man, I suck. They really move around sporadically. Oh, come on. Where is this piece of crap? Oh, there he is. Look at him trying to flank me. That's right, come to Papa. Yeah, piece of shit. Okay. Oh, easy there, Chief. Oh, you just got smacked, bitch. Punk ass freaking dog. I'm gonna go kill the other one, too. There we go. Now I should just get one meat out of this one. Well, that's my own fault, man. Like, pay attention, Cage. You know, you're cooking stuff. You know, stop what you're freaking doing. Just stare at the damn campfire. Because you're sick, you're not thinking straight, and of course the damn thing burned. Ugh, four pieces of meat, guys. Alright, one extra shot, just wanted to make sure. It's okay. Alright, give me two meat, please. Please, have no mercy on me, subsistence gods. I know I have, I have angered you. Eh, I don't deserve it, but that's all right. All right, let's go eat, get our protein up, and then uh, we'll go ahead and do some more farming. All right, guys, it's amazing how well you can do in this game, but you don't burn your damn food. <laughs> all right, let's go. Oh, by the way, my garden is starting to get a little sprout there. A little tomato sprout, looking pretty good, looking pretty good. Wish I could grow protein bars. That'd be sweet. <laughs> oh, man, my, my voice is killing me. Uh, my throat doesn't hurt at all. It's just, uh, I don't know, my voice feels weak. Alright, so let's come on over here and grab this bad boy. I might not be able to do too much building in this video, unfortunately. But we'll see. We'll see what we can do. Oh, we got another one over here. Man, get a lot of blueberries. I mean, blueberries are nice, but with the fruits and vegetables, now with the potato with the tomatoes, you know... I'd like to get more protein bars, but the RNG gods will give you what they will. You know, when I when I go pray to the RNG uh, altar, and I say, please, RNG gods, please give me more protein bars, they're going to say, hey, jackass, you burned four pieces of meat. You deal with it. And I'll be like, yeah, that's true. <laughs> uh, the, the RNG gods are not merciful today. See. Definitely use some more iron because we're gonna still need a bunch of iron for that rifle that we want to make. 
so let's be careful. Uh, there's the fence. So let's come on over here. Okay. By the way, people have been making maps of this game. If you go on the uh, on the Steam forums, people have made maps of the world. It's pretty cool. All right, we've got a dog right there. We're going to let him see what he does. I'd like to get that chest if I can. Let's see if he walks away. You know, nine times out of ten, they do usually walk away from the chests. I guess it's random which way they can walk. I don't know. Let's have a little sip of water here. And right, if he doesn't walk away this time, I'm just going to go. Someone was saying on the forums that one of the most important things you could do in this game is have patience. And that is, uh, yeah, pretty much dead on. Alright. Some wood here. I just get wood as I go along, you know I mean? I'm gonna need it for the campfire. I wanna make a wood-burning stove. I wonder if a wood-burning stove burns things more efficiently. I know you need the wood-burning stove to start making a uh, biofuel. But I think it would be cool if it also burns stuff efficiently. So you go through less wood, maybe. Um, I'd also like that... I, I'd also like you to be able to... Um, in the wood-burning stove, like... I think... I think... Now, this is when I was a kid. We used to have a wood-burning stove when I was a kid. And I believe if you do some, if you don't let any oxygen in it or something, like there's like a little lever you could do for the wood burning stove that doesn't like I think that deprives it of oxygen, and then you leave the embers in the wood burning stove. I think they burn for quite a long time, and you could start the fire up again later without matches. I think that'd be pretty cool. Like I think the wood burning stove should have a, like a setting for oxygen or something, or maybe just do it automatically. Where if if you know when all the wood burns out, maybe like couple game hours that you could still maybe even like half a day i mean i think it could last a long time but i uh, have some kind of like you know thing where you could start it up again without matches i could have swore we had something like that we'd have to throw logs in the wood burning stove you know but then uh if we cut the oxygen it would it would still stay smoldering uh for quite a while so that'd be pretty sweet okay Okay, looking good. Oh, come on, I need more freaking fiber. Getting a lot of blueberries. Hey, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain about food. Like, ever. But, man. Really go for more fiber. Okay... Oh boy. Easy there, buddy. He's definitely walking this way. Okay, let's keep a better eye out and stuff. That I never should let that wolf get that close.
All right, guys, we're back. Well, caught a couple chickens, looted a couple chests. Now we're just trying to make our way home. I think that's a lockbox right there. Unfortunate. And we don't have a key with us, but, you know, what are you going to do? 500 electricity is quite a bit. I've right, got another chicken here. See if we can catch them. I caught two chickens so far. Uh, but I got to start getting home, man. It's starting to get a little bit, you know, towards the evening. Usually what you want to do when you want to when you want to try and catch a chicken is if you're not really close to them, keep an eye out for animals. Keep an eye out for animals. Got one over there to the left. All right, he's going to the right. That's good. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. Once you start getting... He's going towards that wolf now. Now he's heading away. Let's be quiet here. All right. He'll eventually get slower and... Like, he'll take little breaks, and that's when you catch up. Then when you start getting close, you spam the F key... While still looking out for animals, it's not easy, but we got them. All right. Now that we're out of uh, breath, we have no stamina. Let's go ahead and get some wood. And then we're going to head home. And uh, we're going to cook up some animals and uh, get our protein filled up. Try and try and uh, come back from our, our uh, I don't know, our blunder. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, yeah, so we should be in pretty decent shape. There's definitely a, yeah, there he is. Gotta be a little careful here. Where is he? I don't see him. And he's just walking around. He, he's walking away. All right, gotta be quiet here for a minute. Okay. We have to make some more uh, pistol rounds as well. Kind of like the pistol. Uh, you know, for the amount of damage you get from the pistol, I think the pistol might be the best gun. Well, you know, speaking from animals, an animal's point of view, I don't know about hunters yet. But uh, speaking from strictly fighting animals, I kind of like the pistol. Uh, but, you know, I think it takes you like four times more materials to make the rifle round. Although the shotgun's pretty nasty too. The problem with the shotgun is you have to let the, the animals get right up on you. And I don't like that. They could kill you very quickly. Right, we've got to be a little careful here. stuff over here. Let's be quiet. I don't like this area. I don't feel good here. I feel like sometimes I have a sixth sense in this game. Or maybe I'm just always scared. <laughs> so when I'm scared, like, I'm always scared. So whenever I'm scared and something attacks me, I'm like, oh, I knew that. I knew I was going to get attacked there. Well, you're always scared, so what's, what's the difference? Right, let's get back up here. Let's drop stuff off. Probably do a little bit more farming. Uh, yeah, we'll do a little more farming. And then uh, maybe we'll do some building if we can, hopefully. Oh, uh, look at that. All right, starting to take some water. But the tomato's looking good. I'm not going to put any more water in there until... Uh, actually, what is... Uh, water's 30%. So wait until it gets down to 70. 70%. Okay. So let's go ahead and drop some stuff off. Uh, the chickens go in here. The chickens are coming home to roost. Uh, yeah, we're, we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Uh, let's put that in there. There, there. There, there. I think we're keeping this in here, aren't we? Yeah. Could probably turn that on. Yeah, we're at 500. We could probably turn that on. Actually, you know what? Instead of doing that, why don't we... Why don't we grab our materials? Go ahead and make a lockpick. Oh, need some wood. Or should we not make the lockpick and make the power storage? We should, you know, we really should probably make the power storage. But I really want the lockpick. I'm going to go with the lockpick. If you're ever not sure, guys, go with your gut. And my first choice was the lockpick, so. Okay, let's go. Well, we've got a wolf down there. We should probably shoot him. Get some food, right? Save the chickens for later. It's actually a really good idea. Let's do that. Let's kill that mother effer. Uh, we're gonna have to start making some more nine mil rounds as well. Let's kill this son of a bitch. Hello, Mr. Wolf, level one. It, is he like invincible as he's running away? Because I'm pretty sure. 
I'm pretty sure I got my crosshairs on him when he's running away. Yeah, I don't know. I'm starting to think he's invincible when he's running away. Like he's going to reset or something. It's possible. Or I could just be missing, but I don't know. Like, I'm not missing other times. <laughs> so, I don't know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't shoot at them as they're running back to uh, get in position. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save that meat. Uh, well, I was thinking about saving it to eat it off camera so I could actually stare at it while it's cooking, but maybe that would be lame. We need some more wood. And now we can save our chickens for later. Okay, yeah, let's get some more wood. I think one more set of trees, and I think I, want, I do want to do some building in this video, so. I'd like to fight a lockbox, but... Yeah, let's get back. Let's do some building. After we grab that. We actually have a little bit more quarters than I thought. I think I have like 10, which is not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, so that's looking good. Actually, we're fertilizer's a little bit lower than the other stuff. Okay. So, let's grab this and this. And we're gonna need... We're gonna need, uh... Fuel through the night. I think half of this will probably be good enough. There we go. And then let's go ahead and make wooden planks with the rest of what we have. And then go ahead and dump that in there. Uh, we got the meat. We got that. Let's put the bullets and the gun away. I'm going to take some of this stuff. Let's take half of this and half of this and make, uh, let's make nine mil rounds. I'm also going to need more iron, so let's start this up. Okay. Okay, so we can put the chickens away. Chickens are away. That's good. That's good. Okay, so now we're just waiting. Oh, we shouldn't make all that now. Yeah, whatever. I'll pause the video until this stuff's done. Alright, the bullets are all done. We got the door being made. Uh, I do not have enough wood to do anything else. Um, honestly, wood is the one thing that I do not mind being short on, because wood is really, really... I don't want to say easy to get, but, you know, it's the one thing I can go out and pretty much get from anywhere. Oops. So, yeah, I really, I really like that. We have 16 rounds of 9 mil now. Uh, put this in here. Not in there. Alright, so we now have our door. So... Uh, sure. Cool, I did want it to open inside. That's beautiful. That is really nice. Okay. It's coming along. It's coming along. Oh, uh, boy. You know what, guys? I've got some iron here being worked. I've got... I'm just ready for the nighttime. I'm going to have to cut this video short, guys. I've got nothing else to do uh, for this video. So, sorry about the short video, but I'm not going to keep you around for boring, you know... You know, videos just to get to 25 minutes. I only I only record when I think it's necessary. So, yeah, I think that's pretty good. So we're going to call this one here. That is going to be it for episode 6. I'll see you next time for episode 7. Till then, take it easy.